Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Kim with Creative Crafticality and today we are making a super cute 4th of July Dollar Tree DIY. So stay tuned and find out what you need to make this project. Alright, so the items that you'll need for this project are two sets of these bandanas. They come two to a pack and they were in the 4th of July section. You'll also need one of these 10 LED light sets. They have the stars on them. They were in the 4th of July section. You also will need one of these really cute headbands. They have ribbons and little boingy things. We'll probably just be using the ribbons and the stars at the top. That was in the 4th of July section. And then the other items that you'll need, you'll need one set of these cooling racks. They're for um, cookies and cupcakes and things. That was in the cooking section. And then you need a set of these nylon cable ties. They are in the hardware section. Then you will need some scissors and a hot glue gun or whatever your glue of your choice, but the hot glue gun will be the quickest. So let's get this stuff cleared off and we will get started. So the first step in this project is to lay your cooling racks side by side so they line up and take your zip ties and go ahead and tie them together here in the middle so they're flush. So I'm going to use the red ones because they match. And I'm going to go ahead and put two zip ties in the middle here and then one out here at the top and one at the bottom. Next you'll want to pull apart your bandana packs here and we're going to cut strips about one inch wide of the red bandana. I'm going to cut my strips by folding the red bandana in quarters like this and then cut one inch strips and I'm going to go ahead and cut the sewn edge off. going to do is cut the longer white stripes out of each of the flag bandanas. And you also want to cut one inch strips out of the star section. And I'm going to start off by just cutting the strips in one of the bandanas and we'll see if that is enough. Starting in the top left hand corner you're going to take a piece of your star fabric and you're going to weave it in and out of the cooling rack. And I'm going to start by going over the top of the first rung there. So I'm going to go ahead and do this for each of my pieces of the stars. And you just pull it and weave it through until all of the fabric is there just like that and I'm going to do each one and I'm going to alternate between the pieces that have five and the pieces that have four stars so this one had a five star so now I'm going to put a four star Stop at this middle metal piece here so that the stars and my stripes are 
proportional to what the original American flag is. And so now I'm going to go ahead and glue down my ends with hot glue and I'm going to do that on both sides and then I'm going to go ahead and start putting in my stripes. With my LED lights, I already put the batteries in. It takes two AA batteries. I'm going to start leaving this off to the side for now. I'm going to start by poking it through on just random spots in the star section of my little hanging here. And I'm going to put a dab of hot glue right at the base. your lights placed the way you want them just turn the whole thing over here and you're going to glue this down and I'm going to use my hot glue and just glue it right up against where the little where one of the little um, feet are on the cookie tray to give it a little bit more support there so I'm just gonna put a little glue right there. Just like that. My headband, disassemble it because we're going to use the stars and also the ribbons to finish up our project. 
So I just took this off here. So I think I want to put one of the stars here and one of them down at this side. I'm also going to pull, I'm pulling this whole section off that has the ribbon and I'm going to pull the three ribbons that were in there Just kind of disassemble it. There's a little hot glue in there, so you got to pull that off. And then it looks like the red ribbon is tying everything together. Yeah. So just kind of have to pull the ribbon, untie the ribbon, and then pull these three pieces off. If you wanted to use these, you could. I don't know. I'm going to save those for another project, I think. But I'm going to use the rest of them for a hanger. Make sure to get all of your glue off. With the three ribbons, I paired them all together and I'm going to go to my third exposed wire here and pull them through and go ahead and tie a knot. like that and then go over on the other side go in to the third exposed and do the same thing and this is just to make a hanger so you can hang it on your wall or you can hang it on your door in place of a wreath like that and I kind of like how the ribbons hang down. Alright guys so here's my final 4th of July Dollar Tree decor piece. I think this turned out really super cute. It was really inexpensive probably only about six dollars when you purchased all the pieces but there's a lot of product left over. So I hope you like this video. Give me a thumbs up if you did. Leave me a comment and subscribe and I'll see you again next time. This is Kim with Creative Crafticality. Bye. God bless.